Does anybody out there remember a time when life didn't suck? Yeah, it was about 1999. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another Sonic News update for you. And wow, um, well, things have certainly changed in the world, haven't they, since the last time I did one of these pieces to camera? Anyway, so big news from the other day. Uh, Sonic South by Southwest news has been postponed indefinitely. Now, I was going to cover that, but then I thought... No, there's no point. There's no, it's just like, yeah, this ain't happening anymore. Okay, but anyway, something which I think will happen is I reckon there was going to be some announcements from other companies at that panel. And as we've seen recently, Archie... Uh, Archie Comics? No, not Archie Comics, they're gone! Archie's gone! They're over there now! They're over there uh, sipping the Riverdale tea or whatever it is they do now. So yeah, Archie Comics is gone. IDW, I mean, I meant to say. Yes, IDW recently announced they're doing a new comic book series involving villains, which will be interesting if you're into IDW comics. But something very else that's interesting is Jack Pacific might have accidentally leaked or stealthily announced way free. Yes, free. That's, that's free. Yeah, that's free. I might have held a part because way free of their Sonic plush line. And oh boy, there is an awesome surprise in this. So, a bunch of listings appeared on the website ToyWiz, and ToyWiz are kind of known for really exploiting their customers, like their prices are astronomically high. So anyway, what is it they've got up on their website? Well, they've got this. Check this out. Oh yes, my friends, that is a plush for Ray the Flying Squirrel. Guys, we did it! We did it! Remember in the last video, I said if you want a Ray plush, Put that in the comments box. Put that in the comments. I want this in my house. Release Ray. Give us Ray. I want Ray. Remember that, guys. Guys, we did it. We did it. We got a Ray plush. Okay, so maybe we're not 100% responsible for that. But what the hell if anybody asks, guys? Say that we made this happen. That is the power of the comment box. Anyway, so a Ray plush has finally been confirmed. But what's it going to look like? Well, we do have an idea. Because... There was an image found. I can't remember who found it. I think it might have been Pat Mac who found this, actually, but I'm not 100% certain. There was an image found of a prototype plush listing, which the seller... It was somewhere... I think it was a, a seller in China or Taiwan some, somewhere. I genuinely don't know where this originated from, this image, but... Apparently, these plushies were all of prototypes for upcoming Jack Specific toy line, and one of them was Mighty, which did indeed get confirmed and did get... Re well, it's, get it's getting released. It's coming very, very soon, apparently. But we've seen a final image of the Mighty plush, and it looks very similar to this one. And there's also a Ray plush, and everybody thought that Ray had been cancelled, but nope, not according to this listing. It does indeed look like we're actually getting a Ray plush, so... I reckon it is going to look a little bit similar to this one. I, I can't imagine it being too different because the Mighty Plush was very similar to when, to um, you know, when the when the when those preview images get released, like the the renders or the professional photos of the final products get put up on various websites. It looks very similar to this image of the prototype one. So I reckon the Ray Plush is going to look very similar to this prototype one that we have seen. So when's it getting released? Well, according to the listings on. Toy Wiz's website, they're actually coming July of this year. Um, <laughs> yeah, um, how many of you out there think that's gonna happen considering everything that's going on? No? Yeah, well, they're coming. The idea is they're gonna be released by the summer of this year, but I would not be surprised if that gets pushed way back way over there with Archie Comics in Riverdale. I've got a feeling, guys, that is going to get pushed back because, let's be honest here, everything is getting delayed. Nothing is coming out when it says it's going to be because of um, that nasty virus thing. Yeah, because of that. So, yeah, I, I want it to come out when it says it's going to come out because I do really want that plush. I do want a Ray plush and a Mighty plush. I do want that in my house. Do you guys want that in your house? Write in the comments, I want Ray in my house if you want that. But along with Ray, there was some other plushies as well that was announced. There was a Dr. Eggman plush and a brand new Tails plush. Now, none of these have images yet, so we don't know what they look like. But this is interesting because sometimes they do subtle changes and, and differences in their design. Because they've already released a Eggman plush and they've already released a Tails plush. So it'd be very interested to see what these look like when they are eventually released. So anyway, guys, um, that is the that is the big news that Jack Specific Wave Three of their plush lines have been 
announced, leaked onto Toy Wiz's website. They have very expensive prices right now, but that's because Toy Wiz does really whack up the price on some of the lesser popular characters. Um, my guess is these plushies are going to be somewhere in the region of $10 to $20 when they eventually get released. That's what the other uh, plushie lines were like when Jack Specific released those. I think they were about £10 in the United Kingdom. I think they were about $10 in the US. So when they eventually hit their proper toy shops, which could be a while because, oh, they're all closed. They're all closed. You can't go to them. It's locked down. It's locked down. Maybe look, I got my mask here already and everything, but <laughs> we're in lockdown. We can't leave the house. We can't leave the house. They have to come over here to us. They're going to come to me. They're going to come to me so I can go, oh my God, look at this. It's awesome. But anyway, Jack Pacific, if you are watching, if you are watching this video, I will gladly review those plushies if you send them to me. I will review them and I'll say, look at this, it's got awesome, it's awesome. So anyway, guys, flip the comments with your thoughts. Jack Pacific, if you are watching, because let's be honest, guys, we made the Ray plush happen. We did it. I'm calling that a victory for everyone in the Bad Nick Army that said, I want this in my house. So let Jack's... Jack Specific, no. Do you want the Ray plush? Do you want it to come out this summer? Right, I want Ray in the summer! Down there in the comments box, if you want Ray to come out in the summer time when he's supposed to come out. But if not, guys, because remember, it is important safety. We've got to do all this social distancing stuff right now because, oh my god, this is really important and scary, scary stuff. But anyway, guys, so we've got to make sure we keep that up. But anyway, cool news is we are getting a Ray the Flying Squirrel plush. And... Correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't think there has ever been a Ray the Flying Squirrel plush ever. So I am really excited for that. I'm really excited to get my paws on that one. Anyway, guys, not going the full 10 minutes on this one because, yeah, I'm not going to make this a $10 tuba video. <laughs> anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. If you'll stick with me to the end here, uh, we've got some really cool history documentaries coming up very soon. I've been working on really hard on a lot of those for months and something really awesome is coming as well, which I'm really excited. We're going to actually have a special mystery guest coming in, hopefully. So anyway, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to click the like button. Don't forget to click the subscribe and the notification button. And I will see you again next time. Stay safe out there, guys, and keep up the social distancing. Goodbye.